Okay, for this video, I'm going to show you how to create a landing page via the GetResponse account. It's fairly simple. GetResponse, I believe, charges you only $15 a month. You can create as many landing pages as you would like, and they host the landing pages. So you'll get a URL from GetResponse where you can show your landing pages and, and so forth. So it's very simple. Go to your GetResponse page and you want to uh, log in. So let me do that right now. And up at the top, as you know, you have different uh, options. We're going to go all the way to the right to the landing page and we're going to scroll down to create. Now you have settings similar to when you create an autoresponder messages. So the page title is typically is going to be for you to know exactly what it is. So I will just put CL. This is for like a Craigslist test for Craigslist test ads. So I'll just do CL test ads. And again, no one will see that. However, under the description that will appear in your Google search engine. And uh, when someone clicks on the landing page, it will show up in the browser what the description is. So just for example, money again, opportunity, work from home today. Okay, again, we want to put words in here that are going to affect the search engines. Uh, money making opportunity is a big search engine word. Same with work from home. So we want to fill that up in the description tab or box with those kind of keywords. We scroll down and we're going to use GetResponse. It's going to create a subdomain for us since they're going to host our landing page. And they create a subdomain based on the title that we made right up here. However, we can change that. You can add that to whatever you'd like. If, let me show you, for example, if for some reason it is already taken, like let's just say, let's do Craigslist LP. As you see, it says the subdomain already exists, so we're not going to use that. So let's just go back to what the program, I believe it was CL test and uh, obviously they do have that so um, that will be the domain that we will use when people access our landing page. Now you can use your own domain. I don't recommend it since you're already paying $15 a month. You might as well have GetResponse handle your domains. So we scroll down to the bottom where it says next step. And we have pre-designed landing pages that we can choose from. Now you'll see different ones with different photos, different types of fonts, different colors. And we can make changes of those inside the editor. And I will show you how to do that. Uh, for example, let's put, pick one. We're going to use it for, let's say, a Craigslist ad. So I'm going to find something that's going to be fairly simple and easy to change. This one I have not used before. Uh, as you see down below, we can change the color to see what it looks like. Uh, blue and black. Here is orange and white. And I'm going to choose red. We just scroll on the template as soon as you like the colors and we're going to click use template. And now we go to the editor page. And this is where we'll make the, the changes to the landing page. As you can see, a box, editor box will show up when we scroll our cursor down to the area that needs to be changed or that we can have changes. So let's start with the title. Uh, it's fairly big font. It's in red, so that's acceptable. I'm going to probably put um, let's say uh, 
work from home. Now, obviously, as you can see, the fonts are way too big for this, so we'll scroll down. I want to highlight the fonts. And right here is the size of the font, so we're going to decrease it. Use the down arrow. That's going up, so we'll go the other direction, and it's we can just put something in here. Let's say 85 font. Okay, as you can tell, it's smaller. Um, let's make that even a little bit smaller. Let's go down to 70. Okay. Work from home. I was thinking of a title, work from home. Earn big money. Um, so obviously work from home is still a little too big. So let's Okay, let's try work. And again, it's trial and error to find out what works for you. Say work at home, earn big money. Uh, let's go back to this. It looked better in my opinion. The top looked better in white. So this is where we change the text color. We're going to scroll down. Here's white. Click on it. There it is. Work from home or work at home is what we're using. Let's make this a little bit bigger font without it going to the next line. All right, let's say 65. So work at home, earn big money. Okay, so that will be just an example. So that would be the title uh, when someone sees a landing page. And we want to change some of these text, these texts. So we click on the box, and let's just change. And I'll just put online sales opportunity. And we click to the next box. And again, as you know, it's just gibberish. So we're going to put something in there. Start work from home today and earn up to $5,000 in your first 30 days. Okay, and as you can tell, let's just get rid of this other So that's what it looks like. We can go ahead and we can darken the font. We can bold it. Just go up to the bold. Uh, we can center it like such. And if you're curious what it looks like, just go outside the box with the cursor, click on it, and you can see this is what it says. Online sales opportunity, start work from home today and earn up to $5,000 in your first 30 days. So we have three other little areas that we can add things to. We already have an arrow pointing to our sign-up box. So what I'm going to do is just give real brief instructions. So um, let's change this to input your email. And then let's scroll down to the next. And we're going to say, watch for our emails. In the third box, we'll change this gibberish and we'll say, watch our, let's capitalize that, watch our videos. Okay, so that's simple instructions for them. Uh, we scroll over here. Let's keep the arrow. We can always change that, upload it if you want. Um, I just leave things the way they are to make it as simple as possible. 
This is where people will enter their name. And this is their email. Now, here's the important part. In, as soon as we click on this box, while we are editing this landing page, you'll have an option to put which get response campaign you want these people to go to. Now, obviously, I'm advertising Big Idea Mastermind. So I want one of those campaigns. So I click email here. And as you can see up here, get response provides me a little scroll down box. So I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to choose BIM funnel. Select that. So I now know when this landing page is live, if someone inputs their name, they input their email, that contact is going to show up on my get response account. And it's going to show up in the uh, BIM 2013 funnel that I selected and they will start to receive the messages inside that autoresponder. So that's very important to make sure you tie this landing page to a get response campaign that's already loaded in your account. Again, we can scroll outside. We can see what it looks like. Um, I typically don't like photos in here. So um, what we're going to do, let's go back to that. You see here's a trash icon. I'm going to hit remove block. Um, John Carter, I don't know who he is. You can put your name in there if you want. I usually don't put my name on landing pages. I'll get rid of that. Get rid of that box. Get rid of the signature. And now again, this is pretty simple. You can always add things. This is just as an instructional video. You can change the title, uh, whatever you want. If you want to put in a different type of banner, we select that area and right here we have an option to upload a photo and insert it. You can put a border, you can put a link in there. You have all these different options. So what I say is take your time, go through each little box to see what you can do. You can change the color, uh, the background, anything you'd like. So this right here is the landing page I just created. So it looks good to me. I will scroll down and put save and publish. Well done, your landing page is now here. And this is the URL that we created. And let's go ahead and click that to see if it works. And here is the landing page we just made. And as I said, GetResponse will host this for you every single month. You don't have to worry about putting it into your own server. They will do that for you. You can always come back and make changes. It's a great program for such a small monthly price to pay. So we know that that works. So we go back to our uh, GetResponse account and everything is done and we've created a new landing page. Thank you very much. If you guys have questions, you can always email me and I'd be happy to answer them. Thank you.